Good morning from our last day in Florida, full day anyway. We are at Epcot today. The sky is glorious. It was all memorable all week. So yeah, we've come to Epcot. We've got three fast passes. We've got Journey into Imagination with Figment. We've got Spaceship Earth and Frozen Ever After. So we'll get those done. Hopefully get test, test track done because Rebecca's been begging to go on test track and uh, go around the showcase. I've not done that yet. Uh, so you might as well come along for a little journey with us. First ride for us today is Journey into Imagination with Figment. And I also wanted to point out Rebecca's having a lazy day. She's uh, in a rented pushchair again today. We're going to go and try and do around the world. And we kind of figured it's a lot of walking. And she's pretty tired, so she can sit and go around the world <laughs> while we uh, walk the rest of it. I think me and Robert are going to get a food pass as well for the um, food and wine festival. So we can try a bit of the food and the wine. Well, Robert can try the wine, I don't like it. But anyway, back to Figment. That's where we're heading first. Sure you can see with your eyes, but imagine what you could see if you used your imagination. Follow the bouncing Figment. And oh, you have to show her! Show her your imagination! Come on, then. Oh, my, that's you! That's you! That's, that's, that's so special! Photograph taken. Show Ralph. the Mexico Pavilion. Coco, you love Coco, don't you? Coco! Yeah, do you want your photograph taken with them? You can't knock Disney for the theming and detail. I mean, look at it in here. It's incredible. We're going to go and ride the ride in here, which is the Grand Fiesta Tour with um, the three Caballeros. And then we'll come and have a look at the shops and things. Go on. Is that a made up Rebecca dance? Dizzy dance. Dizzy dance. Hi. I love your dress. It looks just like Elsa. So, does that mean that you have ice powers just like Elsa does too? Why not? We don't know. Do you ever wear gloves? No. Do you drink lots of hot chocolate? Why not? <laughs> Well, that's good. Maybe that means that you have chocolate eating powers. I'd like to think that I have the chocolate eating powers in my family. 
Yeah. Also, yeah, pretty lucky though. She kind of has both. We could have a sister day in here. I like your shoes a lot. Princess, it's like looking in a mirror. I'm gonna give you a warm <laughs> hug. So happy Thank you. Oh my goodness. How So we've just been in the Mexico pavilion and I saw this sign for Kid Cop. So I asked the lady what it was about and she said you basically go around the 11 pavilions and you collect little postcards with little facts about each country and then when you've collected all 11 you, you say to the last one you've finished your tour around the world and they give you a 12th one which um, congratulates you. So Rebecca's decided while well, daddy's drinking around the world she's going to go and learn about the world aren't you? Yeah! Yeah, so we've got this. We're about to go on to Frozen Ever After, after our Fast Pass is valid and then, now. And then, and then we're going to go and do that, aren't we? After yeah, Frozen. I got a chili, I got a chili. And you met Anna and Elsa, didn't you? Yeah. So that was good. And, and there's chili. Got chili. And it says, make a new friend in Mexico. <laughs> This is you, the piggy. <laughs> we just stopped in China. Robert's just had some chicken dumplings, which are actually really nice. And he's also had the year of the piggy drink, which is rum, lychee syrup, lime juice, Sprite, and triple sec. Um, expensive, $16. But there you go. Nice though. The year of the piggy is very nice. And the, these are very nice. Um, so yeah, thumbs up. All the detailing for Disney in the China area. We just had a look in all the shops. It's really, really pretty. For anyone who knows me would know, I'm a very fussy eater. Um, 14 years ago when we did this, I wouldn't touch anything. But I've just had one of these No Worries Panna Cottas and it was gorgeous. Um, I've had some ch chicken uh, dumplings as well from China, so very nice. Enjoying eating around the world, as they say. But very nice. If you're coming, definitely grab one of them. It's gorgeous. I just give you an update of uh, how far we've gone the sun is, is slowly going down so apologies if I'm sort of all squinty on one side because the sun's directly in front of me we're having a fab day at Epcot I, yeah. I never thought I'd say that um, I wasn't a fan of Epcot 14 years ago but we never did food and wine we literally came did the ride and left so we were only here for about four hours um, but we've been here all day so far and absolutely loving it 
Rebecca's doing the kid cop thing, which has made it so much more fun for her because she gets to look around and try and find things. She's learned loads of new things about all the different countries here. Um, yeah, we'll show later when we finished it. She's nearly finished. We've only got four more to get. Um, we've had some photos done outside the Japanese pavilion. It's been great. I really, really liked it. We've just stopped at Belgium. I've just seen the chocolate waffles. Mm. And Robert's having a beer because he likes a good old Belgian beer. And one of the reasons I wanted to, to show you was we haven't been able to go on test track yet today. No fast passes. We've tried. I tried weeks before we came. Um, weeks before we came out here. And we were sat having a drink at the Japanese pavilion. I don't know how well you can see it, but I got a fast pass for test track. So we can actually go on it now because the queue's been searching an hour plus. So we've got a fast pass. Yay! Yep. So we are well pleased, aren't we? Yeah. Rebecca can't wait. She's going to do all the designing, which you'll see a bit later on. But I just want to give you an update, really. Um, but yeah, we've, we're having a fab day. Um, like I said, we've only got four more pavilions to do, and then our fast pass. We need to leave early because we've got to start finish our packing. So three more. Is yeah. that all? Three more. I've just been to correct by my daughter. Because we got America already. Morocco. Yeah. It's not America. It's Morocco. Kid cop. Yeah, that's what we're doing, isn't it? Yeah. You're loving it. Yeah. I don't know how many I've done. It. Seven. Eight. Eight. Oh yeah, because of three more. You've got three more to do and you got you've done eight, so eight. go us. Yeah baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, just have a regular face. So we're inside the cider tent. Um, well, cider and wine tent in Canada. Yay! Rebecca's not very excited because she hasn't got anything to eat. We should have no. bought you some popcorn, shouldn't we? I am excited. Well, she's finished the kid pot. So I've just bought uh, a cider flight to try. And Robert's got a cherry. So for the cider flight, hopefully it'll focus. There we go. We've got a lemon hard cider, a cherry apple, and a spiced apple cider to try. Oh. So we shall uh, give these a whirl. And uh, see what they taste like. And for some reason it's not focusing. Robert's wandered off to um, see if he can find something else. Not focusing. Oh, there we go. Hello, we're back. Robert's gone off to the wine bit to see if he can find something else because he was dead disappointed they only got a small cider for his money. It is Disney after all, I don't expect that much. Um, but yeah, we're going to eat these and see what they're like. Well, drink these rather. There he is. ready for Rebecca's first ever go on test track she's really looking yeah. forward to this one yeah. um, so this is the Rebecca this is the vehicle Rebecca has designed using the design studio for <laughs> test track so let's see where we we place in our uh, driving challenge shall we capability test to see how your vehicle designs perform under challenging weather and surface conditions. Monitoring road surface. Connecting to on star. Sim car performance data acquired.
part of the test track they've got these cars you can sit in so Robert and Rebecca have picked this monster truck because they could Rebecca's sat in the seat she's put her seatbelt on and Robert's having a good uh, nose at the front and all the buttons and stuff there's eight buttons there, four, six there, another eight or ten there, plus all those, and then you've got a whole bank across here, and there. You've also and got, there. which they haven't noticed yet, a GM sticker on the side of the car. Yeah, it would be. Fort Wayne Assembly GM. There you go. Yeah, they can go through your car. But you're not having one, by the way, so let's go. Apologies, this is the next morning. Um, it was about 11 o'clock by the time we got in. We'd, we'd actually intended to leave Epcot at 5. We left at 10 past 8. So yeah, things went a bit wrong yesterday. Um, so we never kind of got time to finish the vlog. Fantastic day at Epcot. Um, that was probably was the best day of the entire trip. Um, we did the World Showcase, not properly, but we got to go round it. We went to each of the pavilions. Rebecca did Kid Cot, she completed the challenge and got the special uh, round the world postcard, which she thought was fab. Um, what else did we do? We did test track in the end, we got that done. Rebecca loved it, she thought it was brilliant. You probably saw some of the footage off it. Um, she thought it was hilarious. Um, wasn't a favourite ride though, she preferred Spaceship Earth, but uh, that's her choice. So yeah, um, we had a fab day. Uh, I just wanted to say that and uh, TTFN.